Welcome to Bottle Hunters of Hawaii, the world's best bottle diggers. If you haven't seen their videos, please subscribe now to Third Phrase of the Moon, because you're missing out on something good. Welcome back to another episode of Bottle, Bottle Hunters of Hawaii. of Hawaii. I love it. I love their enthusiasm with every find, with every bottle, every metal detecting adventure. Hey, we're looking at a full on soda work right here. I can see that. They always excavate them properly. You always learn something new when you watch their videos. Educational. And every time I see them dig a bottle, I want to go out and dig one too. Let's see what they got. I don't know what it is, but it looks like a blob top. Like it Let's see. Like it's intact. Could be virgin Come on, baby. Yeah, yeah. Oh my God. No way, man. Booyah. Booyah, baby. Yeah, baby. Hutchins, see, look at that hutch. Hutchins. Out there digging bottles. <laughs> I can dig all day and not find one of them. Baby. They are determined to find some bottles. Looks like we're in a vein. That's where we like to be. We got two bottles here. Like they look like tool beers. But they're kind of shoved up. I think it's coming. Not yet. It's a little tight. Here it comes. Okay. Come on. Ooh, it's After I start watching their videos, I get hooked and I can't quit watching them. Well, right now, it's time to go dig a privy. So, let's get to it. Today we're out here at Old Home Site with my dad, Mr. Nugget, and my little brother, Pebble Noggin. And we're going to do some detecting. As you can see, the house burnt down not too long ago. So, let's get cracking. See what we can find. Well, here's the house, if I haven't showed it to you. Uh, last time I went here was August of 2009 and it was still here. Someone burned it down not too long ago. And it's made out of all square nails and nice fireplace. Stone fireplace right there. And my dad and my brother are over there digging a well, here's Pebble Noggin. He's saving history today. My dad. and uh, yep. I just got the first signal of the day. Check it out. It goes to a Model T Ford. This is my third one for this year. They say forward on them. But, uh, nice find. It's an old house, so there should be some 1800 stuff somewhere. Oh, I didn't find much out here detecting. So I'm digging the outhouse. That won't come off, so I'm digging under it. No, no bottles yet. I'm down about four and a half feet. You can see, dug up one snake, but besides that, it's been okay. So, uh, I'm going to get back to digging. Hopefully I can pull out a bottle or two. Well, I told him to use that one, but he wants to dig his own. <laughs> Covered up, Matt. <laughs> and what do you think you're doing? I'm digging some bottles when I get to them. There ain't no bottles in there. Yes, there is. I'm trying to scoop up some of this dirt. Pull it out of here. Mm -hmm. All right, later. Okay, I'm still digging. No bottles yet, but hopefully I can find one or two. And you can see how deep the hole is. I'm 5'11", so it's almost six feet deep. It's a pretty deep hole. And I'm still digging, too. Little by little, getting the dirt out of here. But I'll get back to you when I find something else. Okay, I think we're in a dry pit. I just dug it out. I dug through the use layer. I haven't found anything. One piece of glass. But uh, Pebble Noggin's down there. I don't know if you can see him or not. There he is. He's way down there in the hole. So, I'm going to cover it in and uh, maybe we can find something with the detector. Oh, we just covered her up. She covered in pretty good. I had to put some sticks right there so the dirt from right here wouldn't cave in and go in there. 
because uh, that was already dug down about four feet and all the dirt would fall in there but anyway I had it covered in so I'm gonna take back to the truck and I'll show you my finds when I get home well as you can see the bottle hunters of Hawaii have beat me again with finding the bottles my dad found three beside a big tree and uh, I found this ketchup bottle in the well and this was beside it and with the F75 I got one relic here it goes to a Model T Ford but besides that nothing else we spent nine hours out there in 28 degrees and froze my butt off so good luck and happy hunting and please subscribe to Bottle Hunters of Hawaii